Hi everyone, welcome to this week's video. So since it's Easter this weekend, I thought a chocolate related video would be appropriate. So I'm going to show you how to make a really simple, healthier chocolate bark. So I've three bars of dark chocolate here. If you remember in a previous video, I talked about the main reason why dark chocolate is so much better than milk chocolate, and that is because it has much less sugar in it. But I know that means a lot of people find it a bit bitter, especially if you're not used to it. So the point of making like a chocolate bark like this means um, is that adding these other bits and pieces to it means that it's a bit less bitter and these things that we're adding are all really good and nutritious. So it's a good way of kind of getting these things into you if you wouldn't be eating them otherwise. Um, so alternatively, you could use your leftover chocolate from your Easter eggs uh, to make the bark. And um, I know that means it would probably be milk chocolate, but if you're going to eat it anyway, um, at least this way you'd be adding some nutritious things to it as well. Um, so the toppings that I have here are just my favourites of Brazil nuts, hazelnuts, raisins and coconut, but there are no rules like you can add whatever you want in terms of different nuts or dried fruits and um, which together would give you lots of healthy fat and good protein and fiber and vitamins and minerals so all you do is melt the chocolate and spread it out on some sort of dish lined with greaseproof paper and then you just add your toppings Pop the dish in the fridge for at least an hour and then you can cut or just break the bark up into pieces and store it in the fridge. So thanks for watching, happy Easter, enjoy all your chocolate and I'll see you next week.